Now, your pets need health care even during a pandemic. Now, veterinarians are changing how your furry family members are treated. Our Stephanie Poole explains. Checkups for Emerson Animal Hospital in West Point is looking a little bit different. To keep pets and their owners safe, the clinic is now offering curbside assistance. The client pulls up, they call us when we're here. Dr. Karen Emerson is an owner and veterinarian at Emerson Animal Hospital. Although the virus has changed normal operations, Emerson says the new protocol still keeps pet owners fully engaged. We actually go out with masks and gloves to talk to them to find out what's going on with their pet. After we make sure that they're not sick or anybody in their home is sick, uh, we find out what's wrong with the pet. We actually bring the pet here in the hospital and we do our physical exam and then we call them in their cars and we go through kind of like what we would do if they're in an exam room, but we're communicating with them over the cell phone. Emerson says a way to prevent the virus from entering the hospital or around your pet is using protective gear. If you are sick or running a fever, we're wanting you to avoid contact with your pets. And we're not very extremely worried about your pets getting coronavirus, but we're worried about you getting droplets on the pets or mucus on the pets. If you're coughing and touching your face and then rubbing your pets, you can actually, if your pet touches you and then runs to another family member, they can get coronavirus from the fur. One growing concern is the number of clients keeping their appointments. To keep animal treatment ongoing, the hospital is offering in-housing shelter for pets. That has reassured some of them, and then some of them aren't able to get out of their homes because they're elderly. So we are now offering here at Emerson Animal, we will actually go to their homes and get their pets for them and bring them here, do the services we need to do, then take them back to their homes. Dr. Emerson says as long as there is a risk for COVID-19, her hospital will continue the home pickup program for owners. Reporting in Clay County, Stephanie Poole, WCBI News. You can visit our website for more information about the program and curbside assistance at WCBI.com.